in this video you will learn that how to make digital object counter so digital object counter means that uh, let me show to you so here you can see the conveyor belt and uh, here you can see the objects are going on the conveyor belt and then it dropping to the collector so if you want to count these objects so you have to connect the sensor and place it here and then when the object passes in front of the sensor so it will count it one and when the another pass in front of it so it will count the two and when the third one is passed in front of the sensor so it will count that the three object now counted so in this way it will work so let's make the circuit and let's see that how it works pick the component from here first of all pick the arduino oh no double click on it now choose the lcd this is the 20 cross 4 lcd double click on it and now choose the led i am choosing the yellow led now choose the toggle switch a uh, toggle logic double click on it and now choose the ir sensor so this is the ir obstacle sensor And if you don't have the IR sensor in your Proteus, libraries are available in the link provided in the description. You can download from there and add to the Proteus. And if you don't know how to add the IR sensor to the Proteus, you can watch my video. Link is available in the description. And from there, you can learn that how to add the IR sensor to the Proteus. So double click on it. And now make the circuit. First of all, pick the Arduino Uno. Place it here. Connect the LED sorry lcd and make the connection as i am doing now connect the ground with the Arduino and also with LCD connect the power to the Arduino as well as to Arduino sorry the LCD now connect the LED connect it with pin 7 and ground it now connect the ir sensor place it here and connect the ground and 5 volt vcc with it ground it then connect the power and connect the out pin of ir sensor with the pin 6 of arduino Now connect the toggle logic with it or logic toggle with the IR sensor like this. Rotate it and connect it with the test pin of the IR sensor. Now let's see whether the pin numbers are correct or not. Let me check it. So IR is connected with 6 and LED is connected with 7. So pins are okay. Now zoom it to a specific area. now how it will works that uh, this will be connected at uh, the top of the conveyor belt and when the object passes in front of it like this so it will count that uh, one object is uh, passes in front of the sensor and it will count it as a one when the another pass in front of it so it will count it again that two objects are uh, passing in front of the sensor so let's uh, uh, check the code uh, let me run it comments are already written with almost every line so you can check it and now after compilation copy the hex file from here so select the hex file address from here and now press ctrl c now 
now paste it in the Arduino now press the ok please keep in mind that add the hex file to the IR sensor as well and that can be found in the library folder of IR sensor so right click on it edit properties and then search for the hex file in the IR sensor folder so here you can see the infrared sensor library for properties open it and here you can see the IR sensor tep.hex so this is the hex file open it and now press ok now run the simulation so here you can see the bright light my channel name digital object counter the project name here you can see the objects so initially the objects are zero and uh, this logic state will work that uh, so whenever the object pass in front of the sensor so it will count it as a one and uh, this zero means that nothing is in front of the sensor and when it uh, goes to one so this means that uh, the sensor sense the object now so let me make it one and then check how it works so here you can see leds blink for few millisecond and the objects are now one so let me check it again here you can see and the object counted now again this means that whenever the object passes in front of the sensor so it counts as a object so let me press it again here you can see three and the leds blink for a few milliseconds let me press again 4 LEDs were also blinked 5 6 7 8 9 10 you can see here objects counting reach to a 10 let me press again 11 so this means that whenever the object passes in front of the sensor it will count it and it will be added in a count so let me press again here you can see and it will be connected like this and whenever the object passes in front of it so it will count it if 10 objects are passing in front of the sensor so it will count it as a 10 when 20 pass in front of it so it will count 20 30 40 50 100 thousand and so on million billion so it will work it like this let me press again 13 the leds also blink for a few milliseconds this means that object is in front of the sensor check it 14 15 and in this way it works so this was the method of how to make a digital object counter the circuit diagram code link is available in the description you can download from there if you like the project please subscribe my channel like and share the video visit my channel for more videos related to arduino thanks for watching